episode of Pandemonium with your host, me, Kylie. Today's game came to us via Twitter. Um, it is a small indie game called Soulbot Energy Rush, and it was created by Freak Out Games. <sighs> Join us as we take a look and see if it's worth the download. Soulbot Energy Rush is made with the Unity engine. Um, its UI is a little bit crude as it was inspired by an idea jam and you can kind of feel that as you play through it. When you open the game, be sure and click the, right, the box in the right hand corner. That will take you to a fact page where you will be able to see a fact about energy conservation. Um, it's a different one each day and be sure and click the bonus key gift box at the top. That's going to come into play later. All right, back at the menu, if you click the shopping basket, you're going to be taken to, that's right, a merch store. <laughs> because that's a thing you can do, buy Soulbot merch. Now back here, if you click the uh, information button, you'll be taken to the freak out team. Hi guys, thanks for the game. And then if you click the gear, you will see uh, settings and social media buttons. And then last but not least, the last button is the scoreboard, which takes a bit to populate. Uh, but I know what you're thinking. I don't care about any of that stuff. What about the gameplay? Well, it's good. The controls are smooth. The animation's nice. Uh, there's a slight challenge to it. The goal is to get all of the energy orbs that have a gold ring around them, um, and then otherwise you will explode if you run into the other ones. Uh, his barrel rolls are very cute and smooth and uh, the robot changes color with each level. Uh, it's just nice. It's pleasant. Um, the really good thing is it's not all about this. There are power-ups like the magnet that will uh, get bunches of orbs for a tem temporary time in the surrounding area and then um, and you will explode if you hit anything. That's where the keys come into play. The keys help you resume exactly from the point where you died. That's good. It's handy. I like it. Another thing I really, really like about Soulbot is that it, the challenge, it does increase with difficulty. And if you do use up all of your keys and you put it away and you come back later, a day later or whatever, and you will come back, um, you don't have to start again at the beginning. And that's what keeps me coming back. The fact that I don't have to restart every time I die. And um, the levels are, they change as you get further up. There's even a level with lasers and stuff like that. Oh, and a bit of advice. When you start to go to your next level, be sure Soulbot goes through the number. Because if you go through the lasers, you'll explode. So, all in all, do I think it's good? Yes, it's free. It's cute. Go download it. You're not going to lose anything. You're going to like it. It's going to be fun. Have fun. <laughs> so that concludes our first episode ever of Pandemonium. I hope you enjoyed it. I've never done anything like this before. I was very nervous to upload it. So please let me know in the comments what you liked, what you didn't like. But be gentle because it's my first time. But not too gentle because I do like constructive criticism. <laughs> And, um, you know, let me know more of what you want to see. I'm hoping to do a little bit more uh, about the behind the scenes of the, the indie game dev, uh, uh, you know, development studios and the story behind the games and that sort of thing. Um, and then if you are an indie studio and you would like me to review your game, contact me either via Twitter or my Facebook or Game Savvy's Twitter or Facebook. And if you're an indie band and you would like to have your music featured in one of our videos, uh, con contact me the same way. Um, if I get enough, I'll rotate the outro music every week with a new song and a new band featured. And also, ha, today's clothes, today's shirt is provided by a wonderful artist here in Belfast uh, by the name of Kismet Clothing. If you can visit their website, which I'll put in the description box thingy, uh, at kismet.co.uk, uh, have a look, take a look. It's it's just beautiful, colorful, but antique, arty stuff, and it's just, ah, it's so good. High quality, love their products. Um, and then if you can 
like and subscribe and I think hit the little bell thing. I don't know. I'm new to this and we're going to learn together. <laughs> You will teach me and I will learn from you. So yeah, subscribe and all that stuff and I will bring you more shows in the future that will blow your mind, knock your socks off. Anyway, I do hope you enjoyed today and thank you so much for visiting. I can't tell you what it means to me. Um, and I'll see you next week. <laughs> Bye.